Let's do a hands-on exercise in Scoop. Log into CloudX Lab Linux console. and type scoop help to get the list of available commands in scoop. Let us import data from MySQL to HDFS. We will import data from widgets table of ScoopX database to HDFS. Run the command displayed on the screen. IP-172-31-13 154 is the host name of the machine where MySQL server is running. Note that we are running two mappers. Dash dash split dash by is used to specify the column used to generate splits for imports. It can be used to enhance the import performance by achieving greater parallelism. If we do not define dash dash split dash by, the primary key of the table will be used to create the splits. If we do not specify this option as well as there is no key on the database, then scoop import command will throw an error. Enter your MySQL password when prompted. Wait for the import to finish. To see the imported data in HDFS, log into Hue. Go to File Browser and navigate to Specified Directory. Please note that the scoop command has created a widgets.java file in your home directory in the Linux console. This file can be used for automating the import. To run a scoop command successfully, we need to be able to connect to scoop database from all of the machines in the cluster. Mappers for importing data will be running on multiple machines as displayed on the screen. If a mapper on one of the machine is not able to connect to ScoopX database, scoop import will fail. On CloudX Lab, we have already done the necessary configuration so that we can connect to MySQL server from each of the machine in the cluster.